you want to cross an ocean. That's in your five-year plan. And, uh, I don't know. I mean, like, you're my significant other, and this is something you're hugely passionate about. Aww. So, if that's going to take you, <laughs> like, if that's something you care about hugely, and if that's something that is going to take you also two weeks, two and a half weeks, then, like, I, I want to share that interest with you. I want to at least understand it or, like, try and show interest in something that you care about and you're passionate about. And Do you love the ocean and could you love the ocean with me? So we just set off from the Namo Yacht Charters that helped us spring off the dock and, and they left at the gas dock there. Now we're on our own and heading out towards uh, the Namo Harbor area, I guess. They're up near like Dingy Dock Pub. Hoping you stop so I So long, the Namo. We'll be back, we hope, we think. <laughs> we took advantage of some favorable tides to pass through Dodds Narrows, which is a narrow passageway that has a really strong current. On the other side, we had a little bit more space for Ben to teach me how to jibe, tack, raise the mainsail, and even anchor. These are the simple things I don't want you Cause these are the simple things Tell me how you're feeling. I'm feeling on fire right now. <laughs> this is amazing. This is Ali's first day of sailing we ever. We got some good wind right now. <laughs> we've been sailing all day pretty much. Yeah. We've been motoring, but we've, it's what, like 7, 6.30 p.m., 7 p.m., and we're still cruising along. Yeah, but we had some motors, but most of it has been sailing today, and it's been incredible. been tacking. We've made it all the way driving. to Salt Spring Island. It's a pretty big day. Pretty good day. The wind is that night we tucked into Vesivius Bay, successfully completing our second anchor of the trip. We took the dinghy to shore for a couple drinks and to reminisce about everything we had learned for the day. Break it down for the camera. Break it down. Break it down. Yeah. Um, well, we left this morning and I didn't know anything and I was really nervous and I was very quiet throughout the day because I felt helpless and dependent. And now, uh, I wish we had caught more on camera of what I had learned today because I have learned jibing, tacking, and how to anchor. I know what to do now if if Ben falls overboard, which is sweet, and that is a huge weight off my shoulders. What channel is the Coast Guard? I'm curious if 16. you 16. Oh, bam! <laughs> my life has been saved. <laughs> Not that I need it. Um, but yeah, I do. I feel a lot more confident about sailing and comfortable with the boat than I did this morning by a lot, by a lot. And uh, yeah, I'm excited about tomorrow. It was, it felt like a jam-packed day for certain. But we had a nap. Happy. We yeah, had a nap. Grateful for it. <laughs> What's your current biggest worries about going sailing? That you're gonna fall overboard, and I will, won't have any idea what to do, and we'll sail away. That. Um, I'm not gonna sleep this entire trip and then we're gonna fight. I don't know what a, a jib is or or anything.